oxygen and the inhalant anesthetic seva flooring. And I'm going to start at the level 7 and 10. That's the mixture. I place it over his head. And I continue to talk to him. I want to comfort him. I watch his breathing. I feel the heart rate with my thumb and index finger. Later I have a stethoscope on the table. It's doing good. Sleepy a little. Watching breathing. I'm going to lower it a bit. Watching. Feeling. Place them on the table. Positioning so that he is straight. A piece of tape to hold his little head in. I'm going to lower again the anesthesia. Heart rate is good. Respiration is not great, but it's okay. He does have difficulty breathing. I want him to be very straight on the table so that the read is better on the radiograph. We can see the organs, the skeletal structure, his bones. He's light, but that's good because I want him light and straight. By light, I mean light anesthetic. I want him even. Okay, now we're going to get out of the way. back a little quicker. Since breathing was his problem, now pure oxygen is good. I'm stimulating, encouraging those breaths to continue. I'm waiting for some reflexes like toes gripping and eyes blinking. This is just stimulation to encourage him to wake up. Good boy. Good strong heart, good breaths. I'm going to stay like this for another minute, maybe. Get the tape off my arm. <laughs> Again, just stimulating him to wake up. Good. See, he pulled away from me, so that's good. He's waking up. Yeah, I like that. I like that. Good boy. Oh, and we're awake. <laughs> And we're away. And I kiss him. And I wrap him so on the complete wake up, there's no flapping because we don't want him to hurt himself or try and take off. That's very good. He's biting the towel. His muscle reflexes are back. And hopefully we got a good reading breath. Good boy. But we don't know why yet. Hopefully this radiograph will tell us. Good boy. Now I'm going to whisk him away back to his incubator.